Iolani Palace is a national historic landmark here in Hawaii. It was once the official residence of the native Hawaiian monarchs. Because of his worldly travels circumnavigating the globe and time spent in Europe, King David Kalakaua, also known as the Merry Monarch, decided to build the palace and the foundation began in 1879. Then construction was eventually completed in 1882. This palace was very significant as it featured Hawaii's first electric light system. It had electricity even before the White House, flush toilets, and intra-house telephone system, and was also the last residence of the Kingdom of Hawaii's last two remaining monarchs, King David Kalakaua and his sister, Queen Lili'uokalani. Queen Lili'uokalani succeeded her brother after his death in 1891 and was eventually imprisoned upstairs in a bedroom during the overthrow of the Hawaiian monarchy. The palace itself is a sight to be seen, with its impressive koa staircase, larger-than-life portraiture, and lavish rooms full of vibrant decor. Included in the sites are the Grand Hall, the Throne Room, the Blue Room, and more. After the Hawaiian Islands were annexed as a United State territory and made the 50th state to join the Union, the palace was utilized for government use, but eventually left to deteriorate and needed much needed care. In the 1970s, renovations began and restoration commenced to perpetuate the legacy of the palace. And since then, the stunning site has been preserved and cared for. The friends of Iolani Palace have worked tirelessly to maintain the beauty of this one-of-a-kind place. Through many volunteers and generous donations, the palace is still standing today. The palace is located just on the outskirts of vibrant downtown Honolulu's business district and is walking distance away from museums, noteworthy statues, and major governmental buildings, including Honolulu Hale and the Hawaii State Capitol.